Welcome to Easy Cooking. Thank you for support through our pilot episode. I'm glad that everyone loved our first recipe, which was a meat sandwich. This Did is my daddy. This <laughs> is my daddy. <laughs> Today we have our assistant chef, as you can tell. Um, I'm going to let her introduce herself. Assistant chef, what is your name? Where we are. Well, thank you for joining us today and helping us with our next super easy recipe. Uh, today we're going to make a vegetarian sandwich, Bulgarian style. Uh, the recipe is called Princesa. Uh, it's very famous through the country and it's very easy to make. Um, we're going to start with a couple of eggs that I have already cracked. Um, and we are going to beat the eggs first. Every time I bake, I like to beat my eggs first because whatever I'm baking, it just makes it that much fluffier. I just need a minute or so of um, beating. We are going to add a tablespoon, make, make it a heaping tablespoon of yogurt. And for the full recipe, by the way, you can uh, scroll down to the description of under the video. You can of course you can watch the video. We'll add a little bit of feta cheese, which is very popular in my country. And we're going to keep mixing the eggs, the cheese and the yogurt. Now when that's mixed, we have our second assistant chef slash food critic in the background because she was Daddy. not napping today, so we figured out might as well have her watch. Daddy, can I put the cheese in? Well, when well of course, that will be at the end. We're going to add um, some oregano to the recipe. We're gonna add some butter to the recipe. That's our final Thank ingredient. You, Lily, can you put the butter, please? Thank you, honey. That's all that I need. Make you some sandwich here in a second. Lily, may I have the bread slices that we have prepared? With the plate, please. Thank you. Okay. Now, we're going to pretty much use the spoon. We can't really spread this with a knife. It's a little runnier than our meat sandwich recipe. So we can just use a spoon to spread it over the sandwich. But what about the cheese? Oh, well, the cheese goes last. I'm glad you asked. We are going to sprinkle some regular shredded cheese on top at the end. As you can see, this recipe is very simple. It takes only a few minutes. I did prepare my eggs yeah. ahead of time so that you're not sitting and watching me do this, but again, it takes very little and time. I'm gonna and I'm going to do can... the cheese. I'm going to do the cheese. Yes, and you can feed your family very quickly. Lily, please do the cheese on top. Please use your hand. Sprinkle it a little bit at a time. Thank you. A little more. Put a little more on that one. Don't be shy on the cheese. I think our second sandwich needs some more. Thank you, Lily. Thank you very much. Now we're going to take it. We're going to put it on our toaster oven can on I broil for can approximately 10 minutes. Mom, Daddy, can I eat that cheese? Mama said yes. Yes, of course. You can eat the cheese. Save some room for the sandwich. No, now he's going to say that's it, not me. sandwiches are ready. These ones actually took 15 minutes. I made them a little thicker on the mixture and this is what it looks like when it's all done. Lily, what do you want to say to all of our viewers today? Is this the new one? This is the new one and it's all done for you to try. What do you want to tell everyone? I'm it's, it's hot. What do you want to tell everyone that's watching us today? Watch our videos. And? I don't remember.
Like the video if you like our food and subscribe to our channel for more interesting recipes. Yes. Thank you, sous chef. Go play. Thank you for watching. I really appreciate all the support. Tune in next week for another easy recipe.